So a lot of my job is uh, handling expectations and timelines and schedules and making sure they all line up because realistically no one else thinks about anything beyond what their department is or what they immediately need in the moment and I get paid to deal with everybody's issues and make sure that they get what they want. So case in point, Vocation this morning emailed me and said, hey, uh, you guys are moving in today. That's all fine. We're all good with everything. Uh, we just need a copy of the contract. Oh, and we'd like the paycheck or the check today, uh, even though I had it turned into accounting for tomorrow. Yeah, the location decided they wanted their check uh, up front before we moved in, which is completely fine. It's completely normal. Not a problem. I just wish I had known it yesterday before I got the paperwork turned in so I could have actually told accounting so they could have it done today instead of trying to rush them this morning first thing. So thankfully, accounting likes me and we got the check. So, you know, got the check. Now we're... Uh, now I'm gonna go drop it off and make sure that another department, Transpo, can do their job by parking all the gear today. Yeah, and that's on top of everything else I got going on. Um, but yeah, you know, that's just the start of my morning. And I haven't even had coffee yet. No coffee, right here, no coffee. So we're gonna have to change that real quick. today fall went away and summer came back with a vengeance in South Alabama I mean realistically it's only like upper 80s or whatever but the humidity man humidity is what will kill you down here thought you should know all right I'm here at the first base camp location for us and uh, starting to get some things dropped off and lined up and this is where we're gonna have our little catering set up and to that extent my tables and chairs got dropped off but the guy had to run before I could get here so this is the lovely side of my situation at times but you know hey it's okay we got uh, one trailers here the generator is here right there and uh you know we got this wonderful parking lot right back here so it's gonna be fun but now the mundane part of counting making sure all the chairs and everything are here got them all 72 chairs and eight tables Woo! final day of prep is effectively done aside from whatever text messages emails and phone calls i get between now and i don't even know because my watch is dead uh because that's you know how much i was running around today um probably should put that on the charger so we're gonna do that so it is effectively eight o'clock at night um central standard time and i have to be up and at work I think at 4.30, I think that's right. Um, crew call is 6, so breakfast is at 5.30, so yeah, effectively 4.30 tomorrow. And so it's 8 o'clock, and I'm done. I'm tired. It was a good day. Uh, got a lot accomplished, got a lot of different changes and aspects going on, but it was a good day, and it was a good final prep day, because tomorrow... Day one, baby. Day one on this movie. Here we go. Uh, day one, and we got 26 to go. So, realistically, I'm not sure how much I'm going to be able to, to create an actual vlog through all of this, especially on shoot days, especially when we do overnights. Um, plus, I really can't show anything from the movie. That's kind of, you know, I signed a NDA, a little piece of paper, says I can't talk about it, but, you know. There's some things we can definitely show and some definitely, you know, some things. But it's going to be a lot of cell phone footage. It might be some GoPro. 
Uh, it's not going to be a lot of GH5 just because of I will be running around the entire time and, and I can't do the vlog and my job effectively on this show. So, this daily vlog might turn into um, a lot of daily live streams at lunch um, or right before call or at wrap, depending on what time we're shooting. But I will definitely try and post something a day. It might be a live stream. Um, I might borrow something from Casey and just uh, you know, write some titles and stuff on a piece of paper and shoot that. But we'll see what we can do. I might actually have to dive in and clear out a bunch of room on my phone and put uh, video editing or something on there so I can be able to create an actual vlog in that aspect. But we'll see. It'll be a fun journey and I hope you guys join me on it. So um, thank you for watching. Click like and subscribe if you want. And I will see you guys in the next one along this 26-day uh, journey of filming with some days off. So thanks, guys. Have a good one.